Okay, so what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm just gonna try and explain to you uh, the basics of looking at um, the, these multi-view drawings. They're called multi-view drawings and they're made up of, of iso, of a, they call it an isometric or isomorphic drawing. And that's what this is right here. And then these are called orthographic drawings, right? So these orthographic drawings show um, a three-dimensional piece from um, from three views okay so this view right here is the top view so if this is your, your main thing this is what you would see if you were looking straight down at it this view right here is what you would get if you look straight at it so like if you were at level with this thing you would look straight at it and that's what you would see um, and then this one right here is the view you would get if you stood over here and looked at it here right and so um, the solid lines indicate on the drawing, the solid lines either indicate the outside of the shape or when they're inside the shape, they indicate that there's a different level, right? So if this is a top piece view and this is a top view, well, if you look, those are this one and this one respectively. So you can see that this one's lower than this one. And so we can't, we have to leave, we have to put something there. We can't just leave it blank. We have to put something there to show that, oh, these are these are different levels, right? The depth is not the same. Whereas right here, this is all one level. And it's hard to tell from here, but it's the block here. There's one that's hidden here that you can see, and there's one here, right? And then this one is just right here, this shape right here. Um, and for your front view, it's the same thing. You can see that this and this are not the same level, right? They're not the same depth. That's why you have a line right there. This one you can't see because it's behind here. And then this one is this front face right here. And this dashed line is here because it's, it's showing that, hey, this thing doesn't go all the way back. And then this is our side view. And this side view is this view right here. They're the ones marked S, right? And you'll notice on this side view, you can't even see that right but you can see this that shows up right here this l shows up right here and then this block is you see a little bit of it right there so what what we, the whole the whole point of of doing something like this eventually is to be able to create shapes and drawings that you can use for creating things right that's that's what they use these for and so they create these multi-view drawings um and so what, one of the things that helps with visualizing this and seeing these is if you shade these a certain way, okay? And so what we're going to do um, in the next video is we're going to talk about how I want you to shade these. Um, and this is going to be a little different from what I initially taught the class because I'm, I myself am learning as I'm going along that there's better ways to do this. And I'm, as I'm seeing the needs of, uh, of who sees this because this is... This is hard stuff. It's hard It's hard for a lot of people to visualize this. So the shading really does come in handy and helps with that. So I am going to stop the video here and in the next video, we will talk about um, shading these things. And, uh, and then there'll be a couple more videos going over the other pages that are in the assignment. Okay, so thanks for watching. And uh, yeah.